Hello there, my name is Vitor, and in today's episode I'm going to build a real size astromech droid. As you can see, I'm a big Star Wars fan, and just like every other fan I have the dream to have my own R2-D2. R2-D2 is a type of droid in the Star Wars universe that they call astromech droid. It's a robot that helps their owners doing simple tasks like controlling spaceships. So let's build one. If you search a little bit, you'll find the astromech.net. That's a site from R2D2 Droid Builders Club where you can find all the references, all the materials and support necessarily to build your own astromech droid. You can also purchase the parts to just assemble the droid. Uh, they spend almost $3,000, more than $2,000 to these robots. And you can only purchase these parts in the United States. Well, I can't buy it here in Brazil. And I don't have access to the big 3D printers or the laser cutters. So I challenge myself to build my own customized droid with materials you can find here in Brazil with the lowest budget possible. This project will be inspired not just by the R2 unit, but also the R5 unit and chopper from the Star Wars Rebels series. Let's start with the dome, which I'm going to make with a bucket and a lot of griblies and lights. Here you can see that the dome can rotate very well and it's already connected to his body made out of a trash can. This droid will be controlled by Bluetooth signals sent from my phone. At this moment, there are only a few electronics in this robot, like the Arduino, the Bluetooth receiver and the module that controls the DOM motor.
As you have seen before, the astromech droid has three legs, and the two bigger legs carry the motors. In order to make him walk around, I need to fix the wheels into the motors, and it will be necessary to modify a little bit these motors to fix the wheels. Now you can see the whole project, the body, the feet and the leg that needs clearly a paint job. At this point, his whole structure is almost finished. I will continue with this build in the next episode, where I will show you guys all the electronics and modifications, explaining how the system actually works and all the droid functions. Thanks for watching, subscribe if it's possible, and may the force be with you.